Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Isle of Asia. So in today's video, we're going to be looking at the safety of Thailand. We will also be covering some interesting facts about Thailand and its safety. And lastly, going through how you can stay safe while living or traveling around Thailand. So in order to get this information, what I needed to do is take a look at some of the crime ratings from certain organizations and departments, look through the latest statistics, and also take into account account feedback from those people who are living and traveling in Thailand right now. I will put the link in the description for the full article that I've written as well as all the other references that I've used in order to comprise this data. So from the data we can see that Chiang Mai is statistically the safest area in Thailand to live. This is based on crime rates such as theft, robbery, drugs, etc. What's important to note is the crime ratings are based on the reported crimes only, and thus it's important to take this into account when looking at the safest areas in Thailand. One source has reported that the highest level of danger while living in Chiang Mai is traffic related. One report stated that police presence and responses are genuinely better in larger cities outside of Bangkok compared to those in smaller cities. This is because smaller areas have a lack of funding which could result in inadequate training and effectiveness of criminal investigation, meaning that this may be one of the reasons why some areas have suffered higher than average reported crimes than Chiang Mai. The only piece of information I've been able to find to disagree with the other data is from the US, and this is from the US Department of State which has assessed Chiang Mai as being a medium threat location for terrorism directly directly at or affecting official US government interests. Nonetheless, based on reported crimes and how individuals feel while living in Chiang Mai, it remains one of the safest areas in Thailand. Unfortunately, one of the downsides about the safety levels in Thailand is that over the last few years, because of the recent pandemic, there has been very limited data. But what we can see is from the years 2014, 2015, 2016 and 2017, is that the crime rate, the murder rate, and the homicide rate have all dramatically declined. So here's some interesting facts about the safety in Thailand. There are many different categories when looking at the overall safety of a country or a place. And one of the most significant areas for safety and concerns in Thailand was in terms of road safety. Corruption is a big concern on all different levels, and this includes public and private sectors. Individual feedback suggests that most people feel safe and secure traveling and living in Thailand. Many also report feeling happy to travel around the city at night on their own. The crime rate of Bangkok is approximately double to that of Chiang Mai. So the question of the hour is how can you stay safe while living or traveling in Thailand? The first tip I would give is to always get the price and this is before setting foot in a taxi, before ordering a drink or before entering an attraction. Action. In some cases, scammers unfortunately threaten their victim with police or other methods if the victim refuses to pay the scammer. When possible, travel with your friends. This may not mean that you are necessarily 100% safe. However, as the old saying goes, there is safety in numbers. The next tip is to always be wary of pickpocketers in the busy locations. Even though pickpocketers tend to operate all across the country, they are predominantly in areas such such as Bangkok. One safety rule when traveling and living in Thailand is to keep your belongings in a safe place. This could be something as simple as a money belt which you can attach under your t-shirt. 